Hey everyone, it's Eric Goins from Flywheel Studio here. Today we had a question on the forum from Rakesh who said um, the horizontal lists within the vertical lists weren't working. I thought it was an interesting use case, so I wanted to make a video about this. What we have is, um, I mean, besides my other database collections here, we have a collection of services. Um, we have two records here. It's just rental and car wash. And then we have some sub-services for those. So we have um, things like, uh, for rentals, we have cars, boats, bikes, and for car wash, we have tires, dry wax. And what I've done here is we have a custom list. This is a list of the services. It's just all services. We're not doing anything special here. And then we've used the horizontal card list here. And all we've done is we've added a filter to the current service. So normally it would look like this when you drag it in. Why don't you select subservices first? And then what we can do is select the current service subservices. If we go to our preview, we can see rental and car wash are two buckets, are two services. And then we can see that this is filtered to those and it does work appropriately. There's a lot of use cases for this, so I thought it, I thought it was interesting. You could have something where you're showing, um, you know, businesses by services by business. It could be top menu items by business. It could be news within specific categories or blog posts within specific categories. Overall, a very cool way to show something that's visual if you if you have the big images um, to users and a great way to break up the monotony of like a traditional home screen or um, kind of a, a detail screen. So Rakesh, I hope that helps. If you have any other questions, just let me know.